You don't worry about who people spend their time with. Whatever I'm doing in my bedroom is my damn business. The people who know what's going on in my bed, they know what the hell going on with my bed and what the hell I do in it. That ain't for everybody on the internet. I don't got to tell nobody where I put my wood at since y'all want to get to it. That ain't nobody business where I put my shit at. Y'all just weird. If you want to know what people doing in their bedroom and who they messing with and sleeping with, you are weird. You're the weird one. Whatever you doing in your bedroom is your damn business. That ain't for everybody. And everybody don't need to know. You ain't got to say anything about what you're doing in your house. It's your house. You ain't got to explain that to nobody. No matter what they say, they can say anything. Who gives two sh Y'all too damn nosy worried about what I'm doing in my bed. It has just been confirmed that Dwayne Wade, the NBA superstar, is leaving Florida with his family, citing that his family would, quote, not be accepted because of the state's LGBTQ restrictive policies. Dwayne Wade's son, I think he transitioned when he was 11 years old. No way. Yeah. And Dwayne Wade is a very, I love Dwayne Wade. He's mm -hmm. a super big hero of mine, but he's, he's a, I guess, an influencer of transgenders, uh -huh. if you will. Because his son is a transgender. He is, I think it was when he was 11 years old, 12 years old, something like that. Mm -hmm. And it caused a lot of controversy because du like little Boosie, everybody knows little Boosie, yeah. he's very outspoken. Yeah. He went on to his Instagram and like completely shamed Dwayne Wade. He was like, bro, your kid doesn't know what they are. Like, that's your kid's a boy. They might be going through a phase right now, but you can't let them just completely transition over. Yeah. Like 11, 12 year old boy tr completely is a female now. And it's not even just from my son's sexuality. It's just about being a, a young black man and or first young and black woman. First and foremost. <laughs> right. Yeah. So everything that comes with that. So for us, man, I don't. When I respond to things socially, I'm not responding because you hurt my feelings. You had Where I'm responding is because I understand my platform. It's I fake. understand that I'm speaking for a lot of people that don't have mm, the same mm, voice that I have. Right. Right. I'm going to require all of you to enter the room and quickly gather around to discuss some important information. It seems that we are at last beginning to gain a clearer understanding of the relationship, or perhaps, the complicated situation between Gabrielle Union and Dwayne Wade. For some time now, there has been speculation and chatter on the streets regarding their divorce, and people have been curious as to what might have gone wrong. Well, it appears that we finally have an answer to this question. Insiders have recently started to disclose new information indicating that the marriage fell apart due to Dwayne's unfaithful behavior, which has left Gabriel exhausted from constantly having to conceal his actions. Rumors about Dwayne's infidelity have been circulating since the early days of their relationship. Back then, one of his numerous extramarital partners revealed some details, mentioning that although Dwayne is satisfying in bed, she would never consider taking him seriously like Gabrielle does. He allegedly flees out multiple women regularly. The informant also stated that despite portraying themselves as, as a perfect couple akin to Michelle and Barack Obama, the reality is quite different. She elaborated that every time gossip surfaces, they make public appearances to portray a solid front. Dwayne is said to be involved with many women, and this is common knowledge among those who associate with him. It is unclear whether Gabrielle is aware of this and chooses to overlook it, or if she is feigning ignorance, which seems unlikely. Interestingly, it has been revealed that Dwayne was not only unfaithful with women, but also also with men. Rumors about Dwayne leading a double life have persisted for a while, but they haven't been given much attention. He was married to a woman before he started dating Gabrielle, and even after their temporary breakup, he impregnated another woman. Some sources suggest that Dwayne used these relationships with women as a cover to conceal his true inclinations. While I'm not suggesting that he didn't have genuine feelings for these women, it seems that his primary concern was to safeguard his secret. Observant fans have noticed peculiar aspects of Gabrielle and Dwayne's relationship. For instance, recall when they separated and he fathered a child during their break. Gabrielle later expressed her deep pain regarding this incident, emphasizing that it was a traumatic experience that she struggled to articulate even after extensive therapy. People have often wondered why Gabrielle decided to reconcile with Dwayne after this incident. A new theory suggests that Gabrielle initially left Dwayne upon discovering his sexual orientation, but he managed to persuade her that it was a misunderstanding and that he was indeed heterosexual, leading her to reconsider. This could also explain why they hastily tied the knot just a few months after reconciling. Some individuals speculate that Dwayne may have intentionally fathered the child as a way to assure Gabriel of his heterosexuality, challenging the notion that it was an accidental pregnancy. Observant fans have noted that Dwayne and Gabriel seldom acknowledge the child, named Xavier, which is surprising given Dwayne's reputation as a devoted father to his other three children. Indeed, he has demonstrated himself to be a wonderful father to his other children, even 
fiercely advocating for Zion. Zion Nazawa, a transgender teenage girl, has faced considerable backlash from many, but Dwayne has consistently stood by her side. He even engaged in a legal battle with his ex-wife to ensure that Zion could freely express herself in any manner she desired. However, there is a question that arises. Who exactly is Xavier? Before anyone jumps to the conclusion that Dwayne might be neglecting Xavier due to disagreements with Xavier's mother, let me clarify. Dwayne and Xavier's mother had been friends for several years before she became pregnant with Xavier. Additionally, despite having a tumultuous relationship with his first wife, Javen Punchies, Dwayne remains fully committed to their two children, which contradicts the notion that personal conflicts would lead him to neglect his child. Furthermore, if Dwayne intended to father a child for convenience, it would make sense for him to choose a close friend as the mother, correct? As previously mentioned, fans believe that Gabrielle may have had her doubts but was convinced to stay through the situation with the child born during their break, and the couple eventually reconciled. For an extended period, fans regarded them as the epitome of black love in Hollywood. Both were highly successful and appeared to be deeply in love, so what could possibly go awry? However, it appears that there were several potential issues. For instance, Gabrielle disclosed in an interview that they split their expenses Evan Lee, a 50-50 split, which did not sit well with many people. Considering Dwayne's net worth of $170 million, which is over four times Gabrielle's $40 million, it was perplexing why they opted for an equal financial arrangement when it would seem fair for him to contribute more, given the income disparity. Matters took a further perplexing turn when Dwayne revealed that Gabrielle was the one who advocated for the equal split after a disagreement where he made a comment that unsettled her. Gabrielle apparently still harbored reservations as she took considerable measures to ensure her finances remained separate from his during the initial years of their marriage. In an interview, she stated that a significant distinction between her current and previous marriage was the implementation of a prenuptial agreement, emphasizing her need to protect her assets. Although prenuptial agreements are a prudent approach, the manner in which she expressed it struck many as peculiar. The situation became even more intriguing when Jaguar Wright shared some information about Dwayne allegedly hosting secret of gay pool parties at his residence. Jaguar Wright is known for sharing insider information, and this revelation sent shockwaves through the community. Indeed, her revelations further persuaded followers that Dwayne was leading a secret life, adding even more substance to the existing rumors. Just last week, a gossip blog shared additional information, indicating that Dwayne had been seen with another woman, leading Gabrielle to seriously contemplate ending their marriage. The blog suggested that Dwayne appeared to be very intimate with a woman who wasn't Gabrielle, having been observed engaging in a close conversation with her for a couple of hours. Concurrently, Gabrielle has shared intriguing posts on her Instagram, such as one stating, when clarity, truth, and transparency are present, there's only room for evolution. Additionally, she posted a picture of her daughter on Snapchat with the caption, I'd do anything for her peace. Observers also noted that while Dwayne frequently posts pictures with the children, Gabrielle is conspicuously absent from these photos. Conversely, Gabrielle has been posting pictures only with her daughter and not with their other children. An insider suggested that if they were to part ways, their approach would be similar to that of Will Smith and Jada Pinkett Smith, maintaining a facade of unity while leading separate lives for as long as necessary. However, the story takes an unexpected twist. The individual Dwayne was reportedly seen with was not a woman, but a male crossdresser. Insiders allege that Gabrielle is aware of Dwayne's liaisons with other people and is weary of feigning ignorance. This is purportedly the primary motivation behind her consulting divorce attorneys to strategize the best course of action. The notion of being used as a cover for Dwayne's activities repulses her. Despite maintaining a semblance of normalcy for the sake of their daughter, keen-eyed fans have noticed that both have ceased wearing their wedding rings, often a telltale sign of marital discord. Cord. Predictably, gossip regarding this tumultuous situation has been circulating, with people opining on everything from the financial aspects of their relationship to the alleged infidelities and potential karmic retribution. Comments such as, she was paying half the bills, so why be surprised? And, I don't feel sorry for her because she chose this after he had a break baby have been making the rounds. Some speculate that this situation might be karma coming back around, given Gabrielle's past involvement in Dwayne's first marriage. The question on everyone's mind is whether Gabrielle will choose to leave Dwayne or decide to reconcile. The public is eager to share their thoughts, as evidenced by the numerous comments on the matter, and are encouraged to watch the next video for more information.